Attention, all pockets. Oh, hello there! <laughs> well, that was really sensational. These are the super snooker shots of the decade, starting off with Ali Carter's insane deep screw shot from a long distance. Oh, my God. That's exactly what he did, One. didn't he? Just part of the red. <laughs> well, can you believe that where he's finished? Surely you can see the green, can't he? Well, we did speak about his cue part. Have a look at this. Wow. I think that's up there with one of the best shots I've seen under pressure. Next up is Neil Robertson's unbelievable deep screw shot. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> And a nice kiss on the blue. Deserved it. Can't cue that much better than that. Just watch the cue ball. Zippity doo dah. Coming to John Higgins' unexpected shot makes a crazy cannon with a brown to pot the red. Leading to Liang Wenbo's thinnest cut shot in the World Championship at the Crucible. You just can't believe that shot is played. Can you? Well, and it, it's uh, compounded by the fact that Liang Wenbo has potted an unbelievable red. One. Didn't look cuttable. Terrific pot. Next, we have Mark Selby's incredible swerve shot against the Milkman. Eight. Coming to Stephen Maguire's genius shot as he finds himself in a tricky spot near the blue but astounded everyone with a remarkable shot. He may be playing, screwing back off the knuckle of the middle pocket. He has. What a shot that was. That was superb. You won't see a better positional Six. shot than that. And well called Terry, you called the shot and he played it to perfection. Next up, O'Sullivan's brilliant cannon shot from a difficult positioning. How about that? Suddenly Joe with cause to be concerned. 32. Using three cushions to promote the red. Next in the list is Judd Trump's special exhibition stuff, leaving the balls begging for forgiveness. <laughs> hey, 15. That's what you call a JT special, I like to call them. And <laughs> Right. What pocket would you like the black in? 26. <laughs> Coming to Michael Holt's superb black with a crazy speed into the center pocket. 121. the very highest quality, the perfect oh. way to launch a five Ali Carter delivers a jaw-dropping shot from afar, oh. leaving oh, commentators in this. awe with its sheer power. Oh, what a shot. Oh. Wow. What a pot. One. Yeah. yeah, he played that in such a way. Neil Robertson impresses everyone with his unexpected shot. Desperately love to have been on this red just to completely finish the frame off. But that'll do it. What a shot. 40. Brilliant. Couldn't see enough of it to take it to the middle, but that's why he's... Next is Judd Trump's another crazy tight cushion red with a thrilling power. And in the list is Ronnie O'Sullivan's risky long blue against Mark Allen.
36. Well, that camera angle shows you how tough the blue was. And Neil showcasing his cue power as he creates a crazy deep screw effect from a long way. But he'll always be, and to many others, I'm sure, a true champion to me. And Neil Robertson finishes this match with an unbelievable pot on the yellow and screw back. He's not on the red, but that's probably the last shot of this first round match. But what Mark Selby playing unbelievable exhibition shots showing who is the real boss. This cue ball. 15. Well, you wouldn't say it was perfect. <laughs> He's gone for another trick shot. Oh, oh no. Yeah. And once again, Judd Trump conjures magic on the snooker table, an amazing positional shot. Well, if he needed an evidence of Q power, that was it. 19. Well, that was an excellent shot. And then, well, let's have a look at this again. Just watch the, the cue ball, the arc on it. And as Willie said, plain ball. Maybe just a little touch of it. Coming to Stuart Bingham's incredible shot, completely unexpected by everyone. Wow, this will be some shot. I'll tell you what, what a shot he's pulled out there. Wow. Great call, Dennis. Fantastic shot. Following Luca Bressel's brilliant opener from brown to the reds. Oh, look at this first shot. Oh. <laughs> Great effort. Just have a look Five. at the cue ball here. As it arcs into the reds. Looks close. Next is John Higgins' unbelievable double in the deciding frame of the final against the Rocket. He certainly can now. So this fantastic final appears that it's going to have one final extraordinary twist in its tail. And finally, Neil Robertson's another deep screw shot from a distance, and this time at the Masters.